said that your initial reaction was that he was, you know, a very handsome man. Mm. Um, talking about beauty, they say, of course, it's in the eye of the beholder, but apparently attractive barristers, lawyers, solicitors are more likely to win their cases and receive favourable uh, rulings from judges in real life. So this is wow. what you call... Pretty wow. privilege. <laughs> <laughs> wow, got I know it's quite something when you think about yes. it. But I mean, do pretty people have it easier? Do you think? Well, I, th I mean, I've only heard of these two words put together, pretty privilege, yeah. about six months ago. And it was one of my daughters was talking about something they're really nervous about. Mm. And her friend said to her, "Yeah, but you know, you're good at this and you're good at that." And da da da. And at the end, she said, "But you've also got pretty privilege." I was like, "Pretty privilege." <laughs> <laughs> about this. What's this? And I think that there is something. Obviously, mm. if you have a nice face and you, and people greet you in a in a better way because of that, there is going to be a privilege in a way because you're going to be naturally maybe more confident. You know, if people always meet you, well, I mean, I don't think it's fair, but I think yeah. you can't deny the fact that it's that is fact. Mm, yeah, definitely. I mean, right. let's be real. There's certain places, certain workplaces, jobs that people do, and you will see they'll put a particular type of people at the front, mm, the front yeah. desk when you greet them, then, the, then what they have at the back. So I think there is such a thing as pretty privilege. Um, and even in the comedy world, they say you can't be too pretty to be a... Com I don't know how I made yeah. it. But, um, <laughs> <laughs> so I was going to say, you're an extraordinary Because you had to double the camera. It funny. You know, they do say, like, it can be distracting and all the rest yeah. of it. But um, I think it, it's so hard on both sides because I know people who are, re like, just universal beautiful, like, everybody yeah. finds them gorgeous yeah. and really handsome. And they have issue with dating. You know, a guy that I know is very handsome, he always says every time he meets a lady, she's like, oh, you must have a girlfriend or you what's must be a player. player. Like, yeah. what's all yeah. and, and so you've got those two sides of the coin. Yeah. Funny you say it's that, though, about women in, in comedy, particularly women, I think, in comedy. Um, I mean, having obviously spoken to lots of female comedians over the years, they often say that they developed their sense of humour when they were at school because they were trying to push back against something else yeah. and they were trying mm. to kind of mm. not win people over but you know to sort of um, establish themselves yeah whereas sometimes maybe if you come through life and you're super pretty from the beginning you don't actually have to do that because well, the door is just open you're not facing all those different adversity yeah. or things that you have to yeah. use humor to heal through so i think that might be yeah. one of the things as well but i mean you just look it, it, it's to the like you said to beauty to the is it the beholder whatever they call beauty it is an eye eye of of <laughs> that's the same thing i said yeah. like, <laughs> <laughs> so, to what is attractive <laughs> to one but person that's is, is... That's exactly attractive. what I was going to say, like, who says who is pretty? Mm. Because it's based on your own opinion, and actually, somebody mm. could really look lovely but have the worst personality Ooh. ever. Yeah. So, actually, it's when you get to know someone, that prettiness can go. Yeah. You can think yeah, they look lovely, true, and as soon as they open their mouth or the yeah. way their attitude or behaviours, you just don't like them. It's yeah. about what they look yeah. like. Yeah. yeah, I mean, you've got to have something to back it up yeah. as well, yeah. haven't you? Not, yeah. It's I not know. just being I know. pretty. It's funny you say that, because yeah. I remember watching, a, I'm not going to say who it was, but a reality show a long time ago, <laughs> and one of the contestants was, you know, objectively beautiful, mm. absolutely beautiful. And I was watching from home thinking, oh, she's beautiful. <laughs> yeah. um, but she wasn't very nice. Um, mm. And within two or three days, I actually yeah. had changed my perception. Yeah. And yeah. so, yeah. like, on the Monday, I was like, oh, she's gorgeous. And by the Thursday, I was like, she's not very nice. Yeah, yeah. we must have all it. gone out with fellas. Well, I mean, maybe not uh, you, listen, but... Oh, 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 Let me think. <laughs> Chatting to a woman, and you think, oh, they're gorgeous, and then yeah. like five, ten minutes no, I did later. Have a boy... By the way, I did have a boyfriend. Yeah. Oh, did you? Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, I've done that story by day. <laughs>